today I'm reading this story. It's called My Granny is a Pirate by Val McDermott and Arthur Robbins. Now I got lent this book by my pirate friends Joel and Kyle. So hi Joel and Kyle and I hope you enjoy me reading this. Let's see what it's all about. has a secret I'm not allowed to tell. They'd chase me if I told you and then chase you as well. So if I share the secret you've got to keep it too. Just swear upon this golden doubloon and then I can trust you. Here's the secret. My granny is a she sailed the seven seas. She captured many pirate ships, but was always home for tea. She started as a cabin girl. She climbed the rigging high and called out to the crew below when a treasure ship she'd spy. So she climbed up here and look out for some ships that she could steal the treasure from. So she was so fierce in battle, her reputation grew. Soon every other pirate feared she'd capture their ship too. <sighs> she kept a pirate parrot who whistled, talked and danced. His antics were remarkable. They kept the crew entranced. My granny is a pirate. She sailed the ocean blue. She captured many pirates and many pirate crews. She made them swab her decks. She made them walk the plank. She made them carry pirate gold back to pirate banks. She loved to sing sea shanties and walk her pirate dog. She called him Jolly Roger and fed him pirate grog. Each evening after sunset, the anchor in the bay, she gave the crew their orders and then she slipped away. She took her pirate rowboat, she headed for the shore without a single splash from her wooden pirate oars. Inside a deep dark cavern, her granny's clothes she kept. She'd change and grab her handbag, climb the secret passage step that wound up through the hillside to the ruined castle keep. But <gasps> wherever there are ruins, you'll find some spooky ghouls and creepy things that drool, some skeletons and ghosties. Wherever there are pirates, there's treasure near at hand. So the skeletons decided to form a robber band. So down the secret passage came bony spooks and hags. And up the secret passage came Granny with her bag. They met right in the middle, the skeletons and Gran. The parrot squawked in terror, and then the fight began. She threw her handbag at them. Without a second thought, the skeletons were broken up before they'd even fought. The best bones they were taken by Granny's pirate dog. They celebrated victory with mugs of pirate grog. Yes, Granny is a pirate. I'm telling you it's true, and if I keep her secret, she's promised if I keep it. Yes, if I keep her secret, I can be a pirate too. And so can you. And if you'd like to be a pirate, you can come along to our pirate club at Little Oaks Preschool. So, if you'd like to come, just find us on the internet or find our Facebook and give us an email and hopefully you can come too. Bye!